There's a major cancer drug shortage in the U.S. right now. Only two companies are making Vincristine. And it's part of the chemotherapy cocktail that is used for most pediatric cancer patients. But one of the companies has stopped making the drug. Spencer Blake is joining us now with more on how this is affecting families everywhere. Spencer, including a family right here. Yeah, take Brenna Rice. She's 18 years old right now, and she was diagnosed last year with a type of lymphoblastic leukemia. leukemia. Now she's getting treatment at Phoenix Children's. But she's only getting the drug every 12 weeks now instead of every three weeks like she used to. Brenna Rice missed the majority of her senior year of high school getting chemotherapy. It's overwhelmingly frustrating. Where? We've been a year of day in, day out fighting cancer and the nasty side effects. Vin Christine is one of the IV drugs used in chemotherapy to treat about 85% of pediatric cancer cases. But this summer, Teva, one of two U.S. companies that makes it, announced they would stop making it, citing a business move. Only now is it starting to catch up to patients. Brenna's mom, Christy, fears the worst. Relapse, or in her case, not ever beating the cancer. The kids who don't finish their treatment won't get a cure. She says Brenna, who now gets the drug much less frequently than she used to, is hopeful the horrible side effects will lessen. She wants to be done. Nobody wants a three-year sentence of chemo. But without it, we're going to have a death sentence. Christy, who is herself a nurse, has started a Change.org petition for Health and Human Services Director Alex Azar to allow Vin Christine to be imported from other countries. I'm completely disheartened that a business decision stands to kill 15,000 kids a year. Christy hopes with the help of celebrities like Kevin Bacon, who has also spoken about the drug shortage, she'll finally start to make some waves of change for the sake of her daughter. Just yesterday, there was a Senate hearing about the Vin Christine shortage. We've also learned that Pfizer, the other company that makes the drug, did get a shipment of it, but they'll be limiting distribution of it, basically rationing it until they're back up to stock in either December or January. Now, by the way, we've got a link to that change.org peti uh, petition. You can find it at azfamily.com.